Hey guys, I'm gonna get back here for the video. Guys, tomorrow we actually have some most feared coming out, but we also have our team captains for today. So let's go ahead and take a look at them and see how they are actually looking. So starting off right away, yes, all your team captain players will now be 91 overall players, which is an absolute W if you ask me. 90 speed, 90 acceleration, 89 agility, 91 jumping, 88 playback, 90 man, 88 zone, and 89 press. Shout out, shout out to Matality for posting all these on Twitter, by the way. Absolute goat for posting them, as always. Keyshawn Johnson has 89 speed, 91 jumping, 90 catching, 91 catching traffic, 89 spec catch, 90 short route running, 90 medium route running, and 88 deep route running. We have... My man Larry Kazanka with 86 speed, 87 strength, 91 awareness, 90 carrying, 76 catching, 88 run block, uh, 89 lead block, and 91 impact block. <clears throat> and then we have my man Sam Adams, 82 speed, 83 acceleration, 91 strength, 87 tackle, 88 play rack, 90 block shed, 91 power move, and 73 finesse move. Um, <clears throat> for our most favorite players coming out tomorrow... We have Leonard Williams right here. He's one of the 87s. Our next 87 is going to go ahead and be my man's right here. Uh, Quinn. Pretty dang good. Uh, we also do have my man uh, Michael Pierce. Baltimore Ravens Michael Pierce. Love to see it. And our final 87 is going to go ahead and be this card right here. Deontay Johnson. And those are your 87 overalls. Uh, looking up, actually, no, part two of 87s. My bad. I thought it was only those 87s. We actually have even more. Damian Pierce, who actually is on pace to win rookie of the year, which is absolutely crazy. Shout out to him for that. Uh, we have a Carolina Panther right here, who is Xavier Woods. Not bad. We have my man's. Uh, Hunter Renfro looking freaking very okay. And then we have a Seattle Seahawk here. And that, of course, is none other than Jordan Brooks. And those are your 87 overalls. Now, next up, we have our 90 overalls. We have Jeff Akuda looking pretty dang spiffy if you ask me with the stats of course he is a man-to-man -man quarterback so i wouldn't mind rocking one of the god squad i'll be honest with you looking pretty good all right we also have my man here cj mosley stat wise not looking bad at all our next guy we have here is going to go ahead and be none other than quentin nelson 90 overall Our next player we have here is going to go ahead and be Kyler Murray. Finally getting a really good card in uh, Mutt. And I mean, okay, maybe not that crazy great of a card, but still very decent card. Not bad by any stretch of imagination. We got Michael Thomas. Probably first time he actually got a card in a very long time when it comes to... Wait, nope, he got most of it every single season. Never mind. Nah, he always gets cards. He always gets most fear cards, which is always funny. Which makes sense, though, because he is was one of the best receivers in the game. He's still very good, but still. Jahir Alexander. And is he man or is he zone? He's man. Oh, wow. 290 overall man-to-man cornerbacks -man, uh, in this game. Oh. Oh. Stephon Yes! Okay, sorry. I really, really wanted to play with Stephon Diggs this year. I want him to get a new card. So I'm actually really excited about this card. Anyway, though, very nice card. As you guys can see, my bad on that one. I've really just wanted to play with Stephon Diggs all year long. So the fact that we got a really good card like that actually makes me happy. Josh Allen. And it's not the Josh Allen that we all know and love. It's my man, Josh Allen, who's a defensive pass rusher. We have Trent Williams, 92 overall. Next on the list here, we have Ray Lewis, my man's 
right there. Look at those stats. Actually, really not that great stat-wise. But still, very, still nice. Very nice. Uh, we have my man's Tyree Kill. Cheetah. Finally, a 93 speed wide receiver too. Very excited about that. Picking him up instantly. Not even a question. All right. So those are the players for most of you coming out tomorrow, guys. Um, now going ahead and taking a look at the promo that dropped today, which of course was the Team Diamond promo. You can get some free cards from solo challenges. So if you go to Team Diamond solos, you can go ahead and actually complete these. And you do get some free stuff. You get a, a Team Captain upgrade token. 87 overall, unsung uh, Heroes Fantasy Pack, and then some more Team Captain tokens, plus some coins. Not bad at all. And of course, the sets are going to be mad expensive. Each of these cards are selling for like three to 400,000 coins each. So expect to pretty much give an arm and a leg just to go ahead and get one of these players. Uh, but overall, wise, these players are not really not too difficult to complete the set of. But the 96 overall, yeah, that's a little crazy. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please.